August 1911. At the Louvre Museum in Paris, a small portrait, the Mona Lisa, hangs in a Renaissance gallery. Until now, she's been a work of little renown, but she's about to become a sensation. After the museum locks its doors, a handyman, Vincenzo Perugia, climbs out of hiding and pries the portrait from its frame. He knows the layout of the gallery well. He was recently hired to do renovation work at the Louvre. Perugia carefully wraps the priceless wooden panel in a cloth. The next morning, in broad daylight, he walks out with the Mona Lisa tucked under his arm. An entire day passes before anyone notices the masterpiece is missing. Then she hits the headlines. Until the heist, Leonardo da Vinci's portrait was known mainly to art experts. Almost overnight, the Mona Lisa became a household name. The scandal had made her a superstar. The police interrogate a number of suspects, but failed to zero in on the handyman. The Mona Lisa had vanished. No one knew if she would ever be seen again.